What's happening, folks? Back with another reaction. Back with some more Marie Fredrickson. I'm going to listen to another tune from this Best Of compilation, 1984 to 2000. And the next tune translates to The Best Day. It makes me think the Sonics might be energetic, if not overtly exuberant and enthusiastic. Now, obviously, there could be an irony or a painful side to that phrase. That the Best Day could be something that you know, it was the best day until something significant happened, so um, there could be more to the story, but, you know, not being able to track the lyrics as I will not be, um, my best guess is that it may have sonics that are reflective of that feeling that you're living through a very memorable day, even the best day. So let's find out if the sonics in any way reflect that, uh, and I look forward to hearing what people have to say about the lyrics, but this is Marie Fredrickson. Uh, the fourth tune on her best of compilation 1984 to 2000 and the title translates to the best day <laughs>
long guitar coming through at the end. She's almost knocked everything over like three times, maybe four. So I apologize to Marie uh, that I was at least a tiny bit distracted. Uh, but yeah, ultimately it's amazing. Like it started, you know, heavier and more emotional in a, you know, maybe sort of pained way than I was thinking given the title. Although again, I was aware that sometimes titles that sound rosy are actually much more complicated emotionally. But as the tune went on, like her singing became more and more powerful, which again, I don't know what she's saying, but some of the moments is like she's singing her heart out, like just the like, you know, full, every bit of passion she's got type of singing. Um, and that, the degree to which that came across got more and more significant as the track went along. And by the end, it was this huge, um, you know, joyful sort of, um, it was like the Church of Marie, like it felt like this really, um, dramatic cathedral type sound um, so in the end maybe the the meaning was more straight away but even so there was that you know um, emotional type guitar like I said at the end there, there's a bit of you know more rock type of guitar that snuck in but um, I enjoyed the the sonic progression of this tune it was a track that evolved as it went along um, and yeah, I'd be curious to hear, you know, what the, the story is behind the best day, because uh, again, it sounds like there's at least, you know, multiple sides to the day, or perhaps the emotional feelings across the course of the day, but either way, enjoying this solo album, looking forward to it, there's a lot of tracks on here, there's, what, 17 tracks, so yeah, we're just about a quarter of the way through, do let me know what you think of this one, I will see you next time, peace.